After six months of hard work, we are very proud to announce the release of Dominion 5. Let me highlight a couple of the major improvements, starting off with the web client. You'll notice that you can now import your files directly from the web client by dragging and dropping them into the interface. You can also customize your user interface. Let me change this color scheme here to a light one. And it's also very easy to manage your users directly from the web client. So there's no need to hassle the administrator of your network or server to make these changes right on the fly. You can now also customize the tags panel to display whichever category is applicable to you. For example, let me include lens, save, and there we have it. You can now also assign, edit, and delete tags in batches via the thumbnail browser or individually via the properties panel. So let's tag these images. Let me just select the first one, uh, select all, and then I hit that plus to edit the tags. And let's add a couple of categories, night shoot, and a couple of keywords. And we hit apply. Here we go. So we see all those tags are assigned straight from the web interface. You can also do the editing from the web interface, changing them by entering the new text or deleting them. You can also search your assets thoroughly and quite precisely by using the search tips. For example, when I enter any criteria, let's type, for example, Carnival, the tag that we've just created, it'll give you some options to select from. For example, if I want to search for Carnival in keywords, like we've just assigned, um, you can just use the handy search tip that is displayed. Lastly, I just want to demonstrate to you guys how you can share collections, queries, or individual media from your web client by just copying the web browser's URL. So the first thing you would need to do is just on your administration panel on the web access group, right click on the actual catalog and then just deselect this option, login is required. And then once you've done that, you'll be able to freely share this URL. So for example, if I want to um, share this search with another user, I can copy and share the URL. And this will provide them with a login free access to the catalog where viewer right access will be granted. This will enable your users to search and view files as well as show all the metadata tags and to also change the language settings if they need to. A great addition for IT administrators is that you no longer need to register Active Directory users in Dominion Server one at a time, nor do you have to track their consistency. You can just specify which Active Directory group should be mapped to which uh, Dominion role. So if you have a look at the preferences section on your server administration panel. You can either choose to register your users by mapping them individually. Okay, so just give this sec server a second to restart. And you'll see now if you go to your users, um, Active Directory is immediately imported in there and I'm registered as an administrator. If you change this over to group mapping, However, you will notice that you have the ability, let's just give this a second to restart. 
you have the ability to map specific roles. So for example, if I want to map my administrators to administrators, I can do that. Editors. Let's map them up to power users. viewers and guests I am going to leave as guests and done you can now also automate the import process by specifying in your server administration panel and upload folder to be monitored and what this does essentially is tell Dominion that whenever a new file is copied to this particular folder it'll automatically add it into your catalog so you can set this up for example with any sync service like Dropbox or Google Drive to automatically import files from mobile devices etc that are saved there which is a very handy automation um, feature and then also you can directly import your files to a specific folder for example um, let me connect to a remote catalog and from this option here upload here you can choose to upload your files directly to a specific location on your catalog so this is a very handy time-saving way of adding files especially if you're connected to a remote system as opposed to having it on your local area network There are also some handy reporting features built into the new Dominion 5. You can see how well your catalog is organized by selecting the analyze option from your catalog menu and that will show you at a glance um, what the overall state of your catalog is and how well it is organized. It gives you feedback on for example unassigned keywords, categories, titles, descriptions etc. It's just a handy way of getting an overall snapshot of how your catalog is tagged and organized. You can also assign user roles now on a per catalog basis. It's a very handy way if you need to, for example, have a user as the role of an editor for one catalog and maybe a guest for another catalog. You would open the catalog settings and go to the user tab and just adjust it accordingly so it works per catalog it's a very handy way of um, being in control of access thank you for watching please head on over to dominion and download your copy today